so yeah, Tom must have been her lover at the time, or at least they were dating, and that's a strange place for a phone. And I'm assuming he died in the mine because of hazardous working conditions. Hey, how you holding up? I, uh, I, I got the message. You don't sound yourself when you're in there. I still can't shake this feeling that this, this whole thing is a bad idea. But I guess you need this. I don't know. Huh? That's the same one? Hey, how yeah, you holding up? Hmm. I, uh, I, I got the message. You don't sound I yourself. I don't know what his relationship is to me. They, they, he seems close. I still close. can't shake this feeling that this this whole thing is a bad idea. But okay. I guess you need this. I don't know. Okay, so some doors you know, I can't go in. I am sorry about before. The uh -huh. relapse and all. Just remember, it's incredibly important that we trust each other. Don't worry too much about her brain. I'll be monitoring it on my end to ensure that no severe damage is caused during your visit. It's not like I can just... I don't know. Ten people. A small wedding. But moving country means making a new life and new friends. Every town has its own May Day celebration. But many people traveled from around the British Isles for the annual Pinwheel, Maypole, Morris Dancing Competition. Such a beautiful English tradition, and a rare thing these days. I'll have to take your word for it. It sounds interesting, though. Borrow a stamp. Don't get to post the order for your something. Okay. Pinwheel primary. Pinwheel primary. Okay. So, did she remarry, or was she married to Tom at some point? Is that a tar tarot card? Strange. I'm gonna keep that with me for now. Mayday preparations. Simon Sharks, make sure you tidy and clean all the upstairs bedrooms. And, uh, says that three kids? I don't know. It says mom, so I'm assuming it was, it's her three kids. Hmm. I'm not gonna read every little thing unless I think it might be important. Because it looks like there's a lot. Don't place sugar in the fridge. Why is that? What? What? Okay. You say so. Oh no. Oh no, nothing. Okay. The Grumpy Knocker. Okay. There are toys everywhere. Everybody loves some toys. Ah, another broken projector. What the hell? Oh, that's a cap. More chess. She must have been a chess player. What was that? Oh, a flute. There's posters of the facility that I'm apparently working at. Mum, do you know where my Mayday equipment is? I can't find it anywhere. I always forget the actual names of the Mayday stuff. It's so odd sounding. Here's the stuff I need. Hats, bells, stick. Okay. There's bells, there's the hat. Stick? No, flute. Flute, not stick. Okay, I need to find a stick somewhere, apparently. All right. Back downstairs, we'll look around a little bit more. The boys hey, used to make lame. the fish talk. What? Ugh. Ew, I gotcha. Slimy, slimy fish. It glistened in the shop window. A music box with the most beautiful decoration. A great man once worked here. Part 
part philosopher, part engineer. His radical new ideas changed the course of history forever. Let's find out what this has to do with anything. Failures. More damned failures plague my work. Equipment has been breaking all of the time, forcing me to buy in bulk or to search out expensive and specific parts. The Hemingways who run the post office must think that I am creating Frankenstein's monster. Sometimes I wonder if I am, especially with so many failed attempts. It's like God is stopping me in my tracks, preventing me from creating this wondrous machine for some unfathomable reason. How can more conversations and contact be a bad thing? A bell. It's a telephone! Ring, 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 telephone. No, go through the door. I can't go through the door. Okay. So it's Alexander Grand Bell, I'm assuming. Such a grand old bell. Hey, there's the other, the other ribbon I need. Boop! I booked it. Did I ever tell you about an odd colleague of mine who experimented with brain cell transplants? Taking them from one memory and surgically implanting them into another. An attempt to reconfigure their minds, he said. Jeez. Fascinating stuff, really. Imagine what we could do with that level of scientific freedom. I uh, don't want to imagine that. A crow with an injured wing, just lying there on the beach. I imagine this was almost a second home to most of the fishermen who lived here. There was a strong reading when you walked in. There's a story to be told here. I think you better keep looking. I am. That is a very bleak painting. Number for you. Hey, thanks for locking up for me tonight. Don't forget to leave the key in the safe so that I can get my room, get into my room when I return. Combination is 1513. Thanks. Okay. Can all the staff please take notes that the following customers are currently barred from Crow's Nest Pub. Please do not allow them to enter. Jen, Mark, Christopher, Maggie, and Steven. Oh, okay. I guess unruly drunks. Lock door when going to bed. Okay. Oh, I thought there's only four. Good job, Restora. Although just I should walking mention, around. the board are going to be monitoring our progress tonight. So yeah. failure to retrieve the artifact is simply not an option. Pinwheel brew. It's the brewy of the pinwheels. Hey, toilet! And another door. Damn it. Hmm. This was so nice. Drink in it. Drink it! No. I better not. Where would they... I didn't see... a safe or anything. Yeah, 1513. I don't... Mm, whatever. I guess it doesn't matter yet. Probably will later. Alright, let's go along the dock see what we can find. I found boats! That was quick. Very brightly colored rope. Blacksmith! The mind can be like a blank canvas, or a picture can be left incomplete for a generation, only to be finished years later in life. The blacksmith was a vital part of the British town for a very long time, but with industries growing and taking over, they had to find other ways to survive and remain in trade. This particular smith became well known for his sculpting and other decorative metal work, but apparently he became a recluse after the industrial decline, destroyed all of his work. Huh. I interesting? It's the crossbow. Damaged floor. Doctor, or doctor. <laughs> wow. Dear Mr. Bell, although I'm grateful for the extra income, I'm slightly worried about the damage you've done to my floor. Whilst putting your cables under my workshop, the floor looks very weak, and I'm very ner I'm nervous every time I have to carry something heavy over it. Anyway, I've made the repair cable you asked for. It's only a temporary fix, but it should do the job. We'll take a, we'll talk about the floor again soon. Dear Aaron, my sleepless nights have now almost stopped. 
The rolling sound of the buoys out in the sea help me to drift off every night, and Poppy sleeps soundly at the foot of my bed next to my tools. I'm assuming Poppy is a pet, right? Not the actual seeds, and you're an opium addict. It has been difficult to continue blacksmithing in the same capacity as an old man. There are so many repairs that I need to do for the locals that I am just not quick enough to do it in time. Anyway, those Wainwright kids have been playing around the furnace again. They come down to watch the toy boat races on the river, but like to take excursions into my workshop. I, I know you... Uh, wait, what? You apostrophe? Your. I, that's a formatting issue. What the hell? Your neighbors were their, were their parents, so could you ask them to have a word with their children for me? I just don't have the energy to chase them anymore. Poor old man. Old men are old. And they're also men. I mean, unless that changes. What is, there's a cable. Yeah, I'm not picking up anything because I want to actually look to see what needs what. Am I supposed to actually break this thing? It didn't do anything. Huh? Oh, can I put it into the lathe and basically rip the uh, anchor off? at all, so... Hmm. I'll have to come back to that. So what else is here on the dock? Beach! I'm have you got an umbrella? Chair. I didn't think we'd get caught out in it today. It's not ready. It's, it's perfectly sunny. Well, oh, get me a suntan. There's another one. A boat launch. Please remain focused in there, Restorer. I can't stress to you how much I'm relying on you to succeed. I've been let down far too many times before, and I won't stand for it again. Oh, what? I, uh, yeah. Yes, I asked you half an hour ago. No, I want you to inject it now. Wait, what? I don't care. They have clearly stated the procedure's intention, so do as I ask. <sighs> Sorry about that. I need to go and sort out an incompetent individual, as per usual. I'll be back shortly. There's that stone that I saw in my little memory base, whatever you would call it. Can I come out very far? I actually can go farther out than I thought I could. Is there any way to get down there? Yeah, she's being a little pushy right now. I wonder if the I can put the uh no, never mind. There's one of those not every single one. I was wondering if I could put that wheel on there. Oh, there isn't some way I can get down there. Unless maybe I can get rid of the boat. Which I don't know how to do yet. It doesn't mean I won't. Just not right now. So the other side of the pier to look in. Was there anything down here? No. Just go back up to where I was before. Beginning. Yes, it does. Okay. I'm glad those pinwheels are around because they're, they kind of stand out. And it gives me good markers. So I know where I've been. Not that this is very samey, but there's a lot of twists and turns. All right. Onto the dock and back onto the beach. We don't Ooh, talk so wheel. loud. You'll scare them off. I'll talk as loud as I want. Yeah, tell me what to do. What the hell? Oh, play boats. There's one too. Can't do anything with them. I can beep at them, but that's all I can do. Hello, Doctor Edmund speaking. No, everything is coming along as expected. He's showing some good progress. I know, but. Yes, I understand. I'll send the results as soon as possible. That was observations. The board are expecting results soon. We sit 
simply can't miss this deadline. There should only be one more memory fragment in this area that we need to find. Please don't let me down like the others did. <laughs> I don't trust you, lady. I, I just, I don't. Something's going on here and I don't like it. I've already been here. Post office. Pinwheel Post, May 2nd, 1966. Oh crap. Disaster. Mine collapse kills 23. Jesus. Yesterday a terrible accident occurred deep within Brimcliff Mine, killing 23 of its workers. A chilling explosion rang throughout the village and could be heard as far away as Devlin. In a routine expansion of the tunnels deep underneath the surface, what should have been a general and safe explosion went terribly wrong when it detonated, causing a severe cave-in. Trapping 23 men, the rock collapse extended to the seabed high up above, causing the chamber to flood and killing all who were inside. Reports that Warden Mr. R. Burton was incapacitated at the time and could not communicate with Mr. Remo, Remo the excavation officer, or rather the evacuation officer, have raised major concerns that this could have been prevented. Jesus. Guess we're back into the bad memories. How? Wait, what? Huh. Interesting. I'm going to teleport back. I don't know if this actually saves it. But I wanted to try the combination lock again. Do I still? I do still have it. So why can I not put it on? Is it not the same? Or is it for something in that memory? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Yeah, well, let me put it down at all. Well, I'm going to have to assume that it saves at some point. If not, maybe it's in the menu. I haven't even looked yet. I just got straight into this and started recording. But um, I'm going to leave it here. Uh, we've made a lot of progress. I don't know how long this game is, um, but it seems like there's a lot of content here, a lot more than I thought there was going to be. I'm enjoying it so far. It's kind of a, a little bit of a hunt to find some things and... It seemed like some things were a little nonsensical, like breaking the glass in order to cut the, the hose. Opening up doors? I understand the glass cutting the hose, and that would have cleared out gas, so maybe not doors. Maybe if there was, like, gas in the way or something like that. That would have made more logical sense. Either way, I was still able to figure it out. But I'm going to have to look around a little bit more. I think I know a few inlets on what to do, so I'm not completely stuck. But I guess I'll see you guys... Uh, next time I decide to record. But anyways, this has been Boylag, signing off. I don't know, AI shutdown? Here.